is filmed before a live studio audience. Carla, you know, for a minute there, you treated Cliff as if he was a human being. <laughs> what you are experiencing is a half Melvin. <laughs> This and I'm going to give you a full milk. I, uh, I think we understand each other. The 1955 AL MVP. Yogi Berra. All right, uh, hide the left field wall of Fenway. The green monster is 37 feet high. <laughs> Do it. All right, here we go. Ike Deluxe, lifetime ERA. 1.03. Had enough. Give it up, no, I'm the woman's a lean, mean trivia machine. Unbelievable. You're the best. I know. Ask me something. I get it, Zeke. There aren't any questions about wheat in there. <laughs> oh, and I suppose you know everything that's in this book. If it's in there, I know it. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> What's the Library of Congress card catalog number? <laughs> <laughs> Seven, eight. Oh, three, four, seven, six. <laughs> That's not even close. <laughs> what do you mean? Look there. What? <laughs> well, that's it, exactly. That's what I grew in my greenhouse. Not another potato that looks like Richard Nixon. <laughs> <laughs> no, no. I have any error on my ways there. Yeah, I guess I was pretty uh, off the deep end then, huh? Yeah, no, but this is uh, nothing like that. <laughs> Look at that. Map of the Hawaiian Islands. <laughs> huh? Yeah, you see these little bumps to the exact shape and formation of our uh, 50th uh, state. Good, huh? Come on, Cliff. Don't make me look, please. <laughs> uh, no, I mean, no, I mean, this is one of uh, nature's fascinating little mutations here. Resting in the hand of one of our bigger ones. <laughs> we have um, uh, CC Rocks. Something with a twist and whatever else Table 10 was drinking. Oh, here. Yeah. Batteries are running low there, Carla. I got two sick kids kept me up half the night. The neighbor's dog went into heat at 5 o'clock this morning. And I am in the middle of a double shift here. Well, on the bright side, you look like hell. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dear. I think this calls for drastic measures. G6? Yeah. Oh, oh, no, not G6. Yeah. been swimming laps in that cologne of yours? No, I just dropped the bottle all over the floor in there. Another two dollars and fifty cents down the train. Oh, the big bottle. Hey, look, um, the Three Musketeers is coming on in ten minutes. All right. Oh, good for you two. Excellent choice. Of course, there's no substitution for the Dumont Pair novel, but all in all, it wasn't a bad translation into film. You better believe it. I love all that dueling. Yeah, and the best part is when Curly backs into that guard's sword and makes that boy noise. <laughs> what makes me think we're not talking about the same film? <laughs> she probably likes Shemp. All right. <laughs> More coffee than chuckles. Who? guy over there. Haven't you noticed him? He's been sitting there for a couple of hours, drinking coffee and staring at us. So what's the problem? I'll tell you what's the problem. He doesn't smile. He doesn't talk. He looks at me like I'm not there. You'd think I'd slept with him or something. Carolyn. All right, Cliff Quaven. <laughs> would be ever so honored if you, a lady, a, a lady, <laughs> would accompany me with your presence at the Gala Postman's Ball on the 18th of this month. You'd be doing this only as a friend. There is no ulterior motive or strings attached. 
Thank you for listening. <laughs> Carla. Carla. Carla, this is really important to me. I know. But think of me. <laughs> All right, look, Carla, you don't have to dance with me, and I'll, I'll buy you a dress. Nah. <laughs> uh, a corsage. A uh, hundred bucks. Nah. A VCR. VCR? Nice touch, but I'll have to pass. <laughs> Good Lord, is that a tear? <laughs> Look, I think my greed is overcoming your repulsiveness. I'll go. You'll go? Oh, Carla. First rule, no physical contact of any kind. Carla, I'm so happy. I gotta hug something. Okay. You can hug me for five bucks. <laughs> That's it. Carla, uh, don't, don't you want to meet your date? I thought he was supposed to look like Robert Redford. Well, uh, he, he does from a distance. Yeah, Mars. <laughs> and I think you'll soon find out just why a planet came to mind. <laughs> Like you to meet Lucas? Lucas, you, you date uh, Carla. Bridge four and a three. What did he say? I can't believe it matters. Well, I can see this is gonna be a laugh a minute. An evening with the stick, the nerd, and door number three. You're not so dumb. Thank you, Carla. Frazier's not my cup of tea, but as husbands go, he could be all right. He won't hurt you. And I think he'll always be faithful. And if he isn't, who cares? 